Thanks for checking out my latest video. This work holding system has proven itself to be really handy. I've included the easel file and some measured drawings in a link in the description. I'd also like to thank James at Fixit Fingers for hosting this challenge and for giving me the push to put this idea into practice. If you haven't already, check out the Woodjigs21 hashtag to see all the other challenge entries. The majority of the clamps were cut on a blue calf CNC, but you can make them with a saw and a router. You could even stack a couple of layers of thinner material to avoid routing the recesses altogether. Once the parts were cut, I sanded off all the tabs left behind. A disc sander made this step a breeze. Make sure you keep your fingers and knuckles away from the disc. It will sand through your hands as easily as it does the MDF. I used hardwood dowels for the dog holes. My dog holes are 19 mil in size, but yours may differ. Widges were quickly cut from some scrap wood. My dog holes are 150mm apart, I use a spade bit to drill the matching holes. The dowels are wedged and glued in place. The kerf left behind from a handsaw is all that you need. The next morning when the glue had set, I flush cut the dowels and wedges and then sanded everything smooth.
To fix the replaceable jaws, you could pretty much use anything. Screws, pocket holes, dominoes, or even dowels will do the job. As the joint is under compression, there is no stress on the joint at all. Lamello Zeta connectors are very similar to biscuits, but they are held together with a small metal locking arm. This arm is twisted to lock it in place with an Allen key. This locking arm makes it perfect for this project. To hold the swivel portion to the main body, I used a T-bolt and a star knob. To stop the bolt from spinning, I used a little dab of hot melt glue, fixing it to the base. All done, now it's time to see what these swivel bench dogs can do. As you can see, pretty much any shape can be held, and you can custom fit jaws for any work holding jobs you may need. Thanks for watching, please don't forget to like and subscribe. If you design a new style of jaws, please let me know, I'm keen to see what others come up with.